Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve the IO1 initialization failed blue screen error you were experiencing on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So this error will typically occur if you have configured or perhaps recently upgraded your system, or there might have been an issue of a faulty update affecting the input-output system on your computer. So this will hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, type in CMD, best match, go back with command prompt. Go ahead and right-click on that and select Run as Administrator. Now, go ahead and paste in the first command I'm going to have in the description of the video here, guys. Go ahead and copy it and then Control-V into the command prompt. Or you can right-click, add it, and then paste it in. Hit Enter. Should come back with the operation completed successfully. I'm going to have a second command in the description of the video here as well. You can alternatively type it in. It's just SFC and then a space forward slash scan now. Scan now is all one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on the keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. Okay, so once that has concluded, go ahead and close out of here, and then you want to restart your computer. Okay, and there you go, guys. Hopefully at this point you've resolved the IO1 initialization failed blue screen error on your Windows computer. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.